As students occupying the legislature watch those at the executive yen struggling with police and their batons doused with water, they moved to fortify their own position. They criticized the violence and called it a violation of power. Students occupying the legislature added a waterproof tarp to their barricade on the seventh day of the occupation. The move comes after water cannons were deployed on protesters outside the executive yuan last evening. Protest leaders are more resolute than ever after last evening's use of force. We will not retreat. I don't think we need to forcibly resist. We are doing all we can to protect and respect this legislature. While students occupying the legislature remain confident, they deplored the use of force by police. After fellow students broke in, others held a sit-in strike and others protested. But deploying such an overwhelming police force obviously violates basic principles. It is an obvious abuse of police and state power. Student protesters say they have no intention of provoking the police. Student leader Chen Weiting pledged to use peaceful means to put forth demands and bring everyone into the debate.